Hi, I'm Kevin Potter, and this is my new hydraulic press. This is a 50-ton unit with a three gallons per minute, three horsepower pump. And this is an eight-inch bore cylinder. So with this combination, you can get 50 tons, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 100% duty cycle. It'll never overheat, and you're gonna be using low pressure the whole time. To get to 50 tons, you only need to go to 2,000 PSI. So it's very low pressure. So your pump will last a long time, your cylinder will last a long time, and you don't have to worry about getting having a hose burst at 10,000 PSI. This press is 3 quarter inches thick, and it's designed for high production stamping. As far as, well, it's as much production as you can get out of a hydraulic press. And it's designed to take a die shoe, which is this right here. And if you're looking at this, you probably know what these are. These would hold your tooling for stamping. And what you can do, once you're done with that die, you can remove it and put another one in to continue on with a different stamping project. I'm going to turn this machine on. It's very quiet. I don't know if the video, if it'll sound quiet in a video, but it's not bad at all. Here's all your controls. With normal stamping operations, you only need to move an inch at the most. So, this thing moves at 15 inches per minute. It will go completely to the top of the frame. There you go. This will control the direction here, this valve. The on-off switch is mounted right here on the side of the pump, along with the pressure gauge. The platen is completely guided, so it stays in alignment. Uh, it's three quarter inch steel plate, completely enclosed. There, the top looks just like the bottom underneath this part. So there's no welds in a critical condition. Everything is one piece. And it's all been welded by a certified welder. So, and the top platen is all blanchard ground. And plenty of room for any kind of tooling you might want to use. And, uh, that's it for this demo. Thanks for watching.